This video is going to be a beauty. If you know of any shortcuts of multiplication by 11, 12, 13 and so on, please forget those for a while. Before we move on to the shortcuts, we try multiplying 23 with 11 in the normal way. We write 23 and then write a 11 under it. 23 times 1 is 23. We leave a place here and 23 times 1 again is 23. 3, 5, 2. 23 times 11 is 253. Took us about 7 seconds while we could have done it in 2 seconds. Let's move on to the shortcut of multiplying a number with 11. 23 times 11. To begin, we write the first digit as is, 2. To get the next digit, we simply add 2 with 3, 5. And then we write the last digit, 3. Bingo! We have our answer, 253. It's easy. First digit, sum and the last digit. With the same logic, try multiplying 34 with 11. First digit 3 as is, then 3 plus 4, 7 and the last digit 4. 34 times 11 is 374. Does this trick of multiplication with 11 work with 3 digit numbers as well? Let's try 123 times 11. First digit as is 1. Then the sum of these two. 1 plus 2 is 3. Then the sum of these two. 2 plus 3 is 5. And the last digit as is. 123 times 11 is 1353. Have you seen a quicker way? I doubt it. Does it work with 4 digit numbers as well? Ok, let me say this clearly. This trick works with any and every number. Try multiplying 1421 with 11 using the shortcut we just saw. The first digit 1 is written as is. Then the sum of these two numbers. 1 plus 4 is 5, then the sum of these two numbers, 4 plus 2 is 6. We continue this until we reach the last digit. Sum of these two numbers will be 2 plus 1 which equals 3. And then the last digit 1 is written in the end. 1421 times 11 is equal to 15631. What about 567 times 11? This one's simple as well. Just that it involves some carrying over. First digit 5 as is. 5 plus 6 is 11. We write 1 and carry the other one over. 6 plus 7 is 13. 3 written under here and the 1 is carried over. And we write the last digit 7 here. 5137 is not the answer. Don't forget the numbers that we have carried over. 7, 3, 1 plus 1 is 2 and 1 plus 5 is 6. 567 times 11 is 6237. So this was super easy. But that's not the best part. The best part is that multiplication by 12, 13 and so on also use a similar concept. Let's see that on a new page. 123 times 12. Understand the steps well. We are looking at multiplying a number with 12. We write the first number as is 1. Then we multiply the first digit of the number by 2 and add the next digit. So we multiply 1 with 2 and add the product with the next digit which is 2. 2 plus 2 is 4. This step remains constant until we reach the last digit. So next, we multiply the second digit 2 with 2 and add it to the third digit which is 3. 4 plus 3 is 7. And in the end, we multiply the last digit by 2. 3 times 2 is 6. 123 multiplied by 12 is equal to 1476. 
first digit as is. Then multiply by 2 and add to the next digit until we reach the last digit. And then multiply the last digit by 2. What will 5692 times 12 be equal to? First digit 5 as is. Then 5 times 2 plus 6. 16. 6 and a 1 carried over. Then 6 times 2 plus 9. 21. 1 and a 2 carried over. Then 9 times 2 plus 2. 20. 0 and 2 carried over. And the last digit multiplied by 2 equals 4. Don't forget to add the numbers we have carried over. 4. 0. 2 plus 1 is 3. 2 plus 6 is 8. And 1 plus 5 is 6. 68,304 is our answer. By the way, why are we multiplying it with 2? We take the 2 of the 12. With this, you can even guess the shortcut for multiplying a number with 13. Yes, we multiply a digit by 3 and add it to the next one. Easy? Try out these three examples to check if you have really understood the shortcuts. 263 times 11, 1452 times 12 and 569 times 13. I give you 20 seconds. Go! Okay, let's see if you got the right answers. 263 times 11. First digit 2 as is. 2 plus 6 is 8. 6 plus 3 is 9. And the last digit 3 as is. 1452 times 12. We use the multiplication by 12 shortcut. First digit 1 as is. 1 times 2 plus 4 is 6. 4 times 2 plus 5 is 13. 5 times 2 plus 2 is 12. And the last digit 2 is multiplied with 2 to get 4. Next, 569 times 13. For 13, it's multiplied by 3 and add the product to the next digit. The first digit is 5, which is written as is. 5 times 3 plus 6 is 21. 1 and a 2 carried over. 6 times 3 plus 9 is 27. 7 and a 2 carried over. And as it's 13, we multiply the last digit by 3. 9 times 3 is 27. 7 and a 2 carried over. 7, 9, 3, 7. 569 times 13 is 7397. If you got all the answers right, well done. Now all you need to do is keep practicing to achieve a better speed. On the other hand, if you haven't got all the answers right, it's not a big deal. Watch this lesson again and try out random examples. Practice is the key to understanding and improving your ability.